Hello guys and welcome to a new brand video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to preview your website on Webflow. So now you will need just to go to your Webflow website and go to your dashboard. And basically now all you need to do is to go to any uh, website that you are working on. And basically what we need just to click on our site and go to open designer. So now let's just click on open designer so it can take us to uh the working space and now all you need to do is to add all the sections that you want and add the elements and classes for your website and you can uh, edit each class size individually or create components so you can have some bulkin editing by adding some similar component like buttons if you are going to use the same button styles on many places on your website you can have your components that will be created and you can create instance of a component so you can have uh, facilitate the work for you and basically for uh, that you can add new elements by going to add an element and add any element that you want like the media forms or uh, text blocks etc and when you finish your designing and finish your website and you want to view and preview your uh, the work or the result of your design you will need just to publish your website just so you can preview your website so basically you will need just to go here to the publish site and here we will find the staging uh, website and basically there is the staging and the production so you can consider the staging as just a preview publish for uh, your website and then you will need just to click on publish and it will just give you a random uh, domain name for your website and you can then uh, see it so you can just click here and basically you can go here for your landing page and as you can see you don't have any favicon or any other things so you can now preview your website and you can see all the elements and results of your website and if you want like to have the final stage or the final uh, production stage for your uh, website publish you will need just to add a custom domain but you will need just to pay for it and as you can see here you can go to the plans and have the basic plan for the custom domain and then you can uh, add your and connecting your domain name to your website by adding other things so as you can see this is my domain name that is already random just a uh, name for just previewing your website so basically this is how you can do it thank you for watching and see you next time